Hey, good afternoon. Um, just gonna have a special notice at the end of this video, so stay tuned and I hope you enjoy it. And uh, yeah, be prepared for some exciting news. can't see him at all. It's all just steaming up when he's working the pack. <laughs> a lot of steam. <laughs> it's my, it's uh, minus two this morning, I think. It's only two degrees in the barn. Yeah, two degrees in the barn. It was frost this morning, November 2nd. And, uh, it really steamed up when they worked the pack today. I've never seen it like this before. Wow. We finished six weeks yesterday. These cows are cows that still haven't figured out how to go to the robot on their own. Um, we've got about, I don't know, 10 or 12 now that we have to fetch regularly. The rest are doing really well. And um, they're learning to come off the pack when it's being worked or when we're adding sawdust and they just all stand on the feed alley and uh, wait. And you can just see all the steam rising off of his pack. 
Looks pretty cool. I opened up the curtains a little bit. We have them on an automatic um, temper, temporary onic control panel, but we don't know how to, we have to figure out how to set it up on automatic, so we still have to turn them up or down according to what we think. Um, yeah, have a bit of a learning curve on that one now too. So, So we have an AM, PM list, those are cows we look for in the morning and at night, and then we have a lunchtime list of cows that are more like a one a day milking. We've got an average of 2.1 milk ready for calves, and I um, go feed the calves while he goes and does fetching cows. So um, this is our list now. We made a master list, and we check on the fetch list to see if you're on it. Yeah, so we're regularly getting eight morning and night and six at lunchtime. Okay, I wrote on the board there so he doesn't have to pull his phone out every time or a list while I'm doing other things. And we just had a cow that failed, it's a trouble cow, and we're going to put her through again. And hopefully it goes on this time. I'm just going to go see how this goes. Keep it dark on the dry cow side of the barn. in the robot room and see from there.
got into the cows tonight, but they've been running around like they're young heifers. <laughs> it's time to go home. We just have the one night light on. And then we're soon turning that off. And we're leaving for the night. It's about quarter after nine. Um, we decided to be brave and we're going to have an open house. It's not going to be for the trades being here or anything. It's just friends, family, and neighbors. And those of you especially who are watching our channel. And we're going to have it on November 30th. It's a Saturday. And anywhere from 8.30 to 5.30 we'll say. And um, yeah, just come and have a look around and see what we're doing here and um, in real life.